Hi friends, term to be discussed today is true and first inventor under section 2 of the Patent Act. This is Bindu Sharma from Origin. Purpose of this series of videos, Key Terms Patent Act, is to understand important terms that are used in Indian patent law. Inventor has been given a special emphasis and privileges in patent law. This makes it important for the right person to be called as inventor to file patent application. That's why the term true and first inventor has been used in the act. So the true and first inventor is a person who invents an invention for the first time himself and is an inventor in real sense. Under section 2, definition and interpretation, it has been explained that true and first inventor does not include either the first importer of an invention into India or a person to whom an invention is first communicated from outside India. So this indicates that true and first inventor is a person who has actually invented himself. When you file a patent application, you have to submit form 1 along with all other documents and fees and if you look at clause 12 of form 1 it clearly says that the above named inventors are true and first inventors for this invention and declare that applicant hint herein is our assignee or legal representative and this clause has to be signed by true and first inventor. Researchers ask this question uh, very often that a person who is assisting the inventor, can his name come in the patent application as inventor? Well, a person assisting the inventor with development of invention cannot be termed as inventor as per Indian Patent Act 1970. Let's take one case law and VB Muhammad Ibrahim versus Alfred Shah Frank, it was held that a person such as a financial partner who has not contributed any skill or technical knowledge towards the invention cannot be said to have any capacity to invent and hence cannot be said to be the inventor. So this also indicates that inventor has to be a person who has actually invented. Now we will have a look at few of the sections where the term true and first inventor has been used. Under section 6, persons entitled to apply for patents, an application for a patent may be made by any of the following person. Number 1, by any person claiming to be the true and first, in first inventor of the invention. Number 2, by assignee of the person claiming to be the true and first inventor in respect of the right to make such an application. Number three, by the legal representative of any deceased person who immediately before his death was entitled to make such an application. Section 7, Form of Application says that every application for patent shall state that applicant is in possession of the invention and shall name the person claiming to be the true and first inventor and, and where the person so claiming is not the applicant or one of the applicants, the application shall contain a declaration that the applicant believes the person so named to be the true and first inventor. Section 31 Anticipation by Public Display etc. says that an invention claimed in a complete specification shall not be deemed to have been anticipated if the invention has been displayed or used with the consent of the true and first inventor at an industrial or other exhibition to which the provisions of this section have been extended by the central government by notification in the official gazette. At the time of filing patent application, declaration as to inventorship has to be submitted and this is a statement to be given by the inventor on form 5 to confirm that he or she is true and first inventor of the invention disclosed in complete specification. 
in form 5 uh, there has to be declaration made by the true and first inventor and if you read the clause 1 name of the applicant so here the applicant has to declare that true and first inventor of the invention disclosed in complete specification filed in pursuance of uh, their application number so and so are following so in, in the clause number two inventor has to sign it and prove that he is true and first inventor of the application now it's time for the question the so question for the day is which of the following can be termed as true and first inventor option one the first importer of the invention to India option B the person who invents the invention for the first time option 3 the person to whom the invention is sold for the first time option D is a person to whom an invention is first communicated from outside India you can put your answers in the comment section below thank you for watching this video for any queries related to our services you can contact us Email ID and phone number is given in the video description. See you next week. Till then, keep learning and keep innovating.